up everybody this is charlotte and this is davian and today we are doing a review on this wig right here so if you're interested stay tuned mm -hmm. premium seven star wig it's a lace front wig um it has a flat laid parting as you can see from this picture and this is the box that it comes in obviously it's really nice um it is called vera it is in the color ts taffy and on the back of the box it shows you the model with the wig on and it tells you that it's 400 degrees flat iron safe and it shows you all the other multiple colors so of course when you open the box the wig is going to be laying in there with a nice little paper over it um and the wig is connected with the card so the front of the card looks exactly like the front of the box and it shows you the parting space on there um it also shows you the model on the back of the card just like it's on the back of the box um it also tells you that it's flat iron safe on the inside of the car card not card <laughs> You have all the colors, and it tells you on the inside of the car card at the top, it tells you about the hair, how to style it, how to wash it, everything that you need to know about that. So, yeah, it's just the main stuff. Okay, so as far as the wig itself, um, it is hard lace. So I did cut off the lace. Um, I did get a little bit of shedding as you always will when you cut off the lace. Um, now further, you know, from that point on, I have not received any shedding from the hair. Um, it does tangle a little bit because it is curly hair, but I mean, it's not anything, you know, crazy that you can't just comb out. Like I said, I've had the wig for, see, there's a little tangling. I've had it for two uh, months. But, you know, how you take care of it. Yeah, it's, it's very minimal. And I just put it on my ugly doll head here um, when I take her off so that she can stay intact. But other than that, um, the wig does come with three combs. There's a comb here and a comb on the side and then one comb in the back. Now, the two combs are here because they are, um, this is supposed to be a side part wig, which I do have an issue with. That was one of my cons on this wig because um, when you turn it to the side, it is not the same length. This side is short and this side is longer. So you do have to trim this if you want to wear this as a side part. You will have to trim the side. So that the sides are even and when you look at the card she has her wig on the side so I don't know what that's about maybe because her side is not as deep side part as mine is but whatever so um, this is the parting and I did I did pluck the parting and um, I also put a little concealer on it which now looking at it looks like a lot of concealer but um, it looks really natural when I wear it out and I've, you know, fooled a couple of people into thinking it was my real hair. Um, I didn't tell them that, but they, they thought it was. But anyways, the lace is very light, as you guys can see. So here, I normally take a, um, dark brown, um, eyeliner and go over this lace here. You can also use mascara, whatever you, you know, choose to use to cover that lace. If you don't cut it off all the way and if you don't glue it down um, yeah but the wig lays really flat um, like right here and you just need to put some powder over the line of demarcation or leave some edges out and it will be fine but um, this is the hair it has lots of pretty layers in it and the color is very very gorgeous 
as you can see here um, there's dark browns at the root and then it comes into lighter browns and into a blonde so this is the left side of the hair and um, it is a little bit tangled in there because I didn't comb it out but uh, yeah that's the left side we'll just do the back that's the back it is about um, between 16 and 18 inches long and uh, if you want to straighten it or stretch it out then do that before you cut it because it's not going to be the same if you cut it but um, I would not advise to straighten this wig out I would just advise to get something that's already straight um, and Use this Medicare, not human. yes and this is the um, left side of the hair and um this is where all of the right curls side. i'm sorry the right side. yeah the right side i forgot what side i was on this is the right side <laughs> of the wig and has all the layers and the bang and you know it's most of the curls is on that side so um this wig is a really good wig you know for going out on a date or somewhere elegant um you can take the wig and I put like a, a nice twist, flat twist on this side. And you know, you can wear it on one side and have that nice little elegant look if you like. And um, you can turn it, wear it as a middle part. I don't do middle parts, so I won't be showing you that. <laughs> um, I have a huge forehead, so that, that's not gonna be something we'll show today. But you can just run your fingers through this hair and then just get the the nice layer effect going in there like um one thing that i don't like about this hair is that it is kind of big for my taste on the sides so i kind of have to like press it down so if you don't like full hair nice big curls then i would not suggest this wig for you but if you like full curls you know big hair then yeah this is the wig for you um it is a little flat at the top for me for the hair to be so full down here and be kind of flat here but you can kind of you know puff it up it did say it was a flat blade part so that is very true if she said it's flat so no yeah it is <laughs> it is very flat laid at the top you know but uh i mean if you want to puff it up a little bit you can um just to give it a little bit more volume and just fluff the curls out if you like whatever your taste is uh this wig is a little bit hot underneath because it is a lot of hair the hair texture is um a light yakky so it's not silky but it's not too kinky um it's a very nice tex texture it's uh you know kind of soft so um yeah other than that i think i really love this wig i think i paid in between 25 and 30 dollars for it i'll leave all that information down in the description box below um with a link to the wig and uh yeah so that's my review on this hair i really love this hair another thing she forgot to mention is that is the tangling and the the nape area that is a very natural thing for a wig and i you know i talked about it a lot but um under on this week it happened so she just wanted to go let you know but she forgot so yeah i did forget <laughs> so underneath yeah it does have a little bit of tangling um and as i said it does get a little bit of tangling here and there but it's not a synthetic unit thing it's all hair i've had human hair that mats underneath just the same so it's it's not a synthetic thing so um we don't really mention tangling and shedding a lot in our videos because it's, it's just natural hair yeah thing. it's just no a common thing is, so. yeah it's just it's gonna do that it's hair your own personal hair does that so don't worry about that if you're worried about that then i don't know wig life not may not be your thing <laughs> but uh yeah other than that this wig is a really good wig um you can style it however you want it and my review is go get this wig if you like it and if you love this color because i love this color i'm looking for more wigs in this color so um i give this wig an eight because i did not like the fact that i had to cut that um and cut some of this down but other than that that's our review like us comment and subscribe and we'll see you next time bye bye